corporate people listen to you. I mean, you know, inadequate light sources, no brains on these people. So stuffy and stupid in here. Making stupid decisions, stupid meetings. You just got, and, and, and paychecks are all Doses and some change. Double my shift, and now I have to work on Saturday and Sunday too. Sunday evenings as well. Ruining situations. You're not gonna see this coming. Stick me in this tiny box with all these little things all over the place. Just little monitors that don't even start and it's having power failures, and the windows are so small. Five and a quarter inch floppy disk from my Commodore 67. Flipping the switches and pushing the buttons. So let me put the badge seal in my lunchbox. Oh, I'll show them. They're gonna be so sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> This wasn't supposed to happen. This wasn't supposed to happen. I wasn't supposed to happen. I wasn't supposed to cease to exist at this particular moment. What? What's going on? When I was a baby bunny, you held me through the night. Upon your supple teat, I'd suck until my heart's delight. You taught me how to pee standing, you taught me how to fight. You're my mom until the end, although I have been reprogrammed. I'll never hit you with this guitar. Mom, I love you. Are you seriously singing a song right now? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, was it something I said? Oh, why did you stop my song? It That dinosaur? I will mess you up, man! What are these? Bunch of shoulder guns, arm guns, finger guns, leg guns, pea shooter down there. I bet you could cause some damage. Whoa! Get your hands off of me! You don't know who I am! I need adult supervision! Mom! Where's Mom? I tried to kill her. Come with me if you want to live, man. Yes. What is this place? Limbo 74, reserved for the pure of heart. Yes. Mm. I'm fascinated with life, always have been, particularly with life I did not create. And these two have never failed to entertain me. A plaything made by man for his children to enjoy, brought to life by a computer virus. A weapon of war, created by the same man to destroy everything, including his own children. Two sides of the coin, yin and yang, complete opposites, but also the best of friends. After numerous adventures together through space and time, the battles have taken their toll on the poor bunny's mechanical body. Unlike his yellow counterpart, he is not equipped with a military-grade auto repair, which means they now have needs. And I, being the loving creature that I am, am happy to provide. My agent has spread the word, and they will answer the call, and I will enjoy each moment of the entertainment that follows. I found a job for you guys. The hazards are high, but it's all about that cream, right? <laughs> I like you, Ganny. You talk funny. 
Venusian hot waxes are expensive, and I don't have an auto repair function like Gunny, so I need cash. Green is for the money, gold is for the honey. Yes. Honey. The well-armed scary yellow guy is speaking my language. Here's the lowdown. It's a hit. Very powerful player. This guy owns an entire city that he built with his own two hands. Apparently a retired Norse god. What? A retired god? How do you retire from being a god? Did the government send you welfare souls or something? I mean, how would you even take down a god? I figure you guys are a bit hard to kill. Do I need like a plus two golden pig tooth? Or a Macarena of Time or, or what? Nah, man. Gods can be killed. Believe me, we've had our share of rumbles back in the day and lost a lot of homies. But the thing about gods, man, they're real. Real good at getting out of the way. Not to mention all the loopholes of the various underworlds. Ah, I'm not even gonna pretend to have understood all that. So how about I just sing a song? If my mom was here, I know she'd be glad. Money's on adventures. Money's having fun. Look at all these new friends that I have. Some of them talk funny. Some of them is a gun. But deep inside my process. Take it outside, fellas. No, 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 no! Yes. <laughs> okay, you won. Wait for me, guys. It's my lunch break anyways. Okay, I'll drop you off. There's a contact waiting near the target area by the name of Nimrod. He'll give you further instructions. I am, and you are Bunny and Gunny. I've been waiting for you. Before I give you the contract or promise any payment, I need for you to prove your worth in battle. You may have noticed this town has a Viking infestation. They're resilient little pests, aren't they? I need you to defeat 25 of them. Shouldn't be that hard for you. But if it is, you can say goodbye to a huge pile of cash. Cash for honeys? For whatever you feel like. I honestly don't care. Auto repair for money, yes. Oh yeah, thanks Gunny. I'll spend mine on an auto repair unit. The deluxe model, with extra deluxe. So much deluxing. Seriously, I could care less. When you are done with the small task, find me in the city. I'll be, uh, somewhere. Good luck and goodbye, if you fail. So you made it back. Well, I'm not unimpressed. They're here! No matter where you go, there you are. Yes. Nice. Yours was way more relevant to this mu- Jeez, this sentence is long. What was I saying? If you two are finished, we can get down to business. Behind me, you'll see a pathetic attempt at constructing a resemblance of the Great Tower of Babel. In the courtyard beyond the fences, you will find Thor. He is your target. Be alert. He has the experience of countless wars throughout the centuries on his side. One mistake, and he will destroy you. Do not underestimate him. Ah oh, man! We came all this way, and all this here is one-fifth of the village, people! It's gonna be a lame show without the Indian and the Navy guy! Perhaps the construction will What a gift, man! Yeah. I can't believe Kenny would send us out here and there's no one here but David Hodo over there! Huh? You should never trust a robot when he's promising a job! Especially when one named Nemrod makes you fight an angry mob! He sent us to an empty place that just this guy the human race a walking bag of skin and bones It looks like Thor is not at home I bet he wants a skinny chump not big enough to bite my rump But I'll just sing this song for him and when he comes I'll beat his lips Oh! Thor sucks, Thor sucks, I need some more something nuts Thor sucks, Thor sucks, sucky 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 sucks Whoa! Whoa! Cut it out! You'll be in pieces soon enough! Found it! A machine, bested by a machine. I've slain dragons and giants. This is no honorable way to fall in battle. Ooh, shiny. 
only the worthy may wield that. I have known only three to have the ability in the last three millennia. Stop before you damage yourself. What the hell happened? Hell is precisely what happened. Norse goddess who presides over the underworld. This defeat was not honorable by their standards. She saw her opportunity and seized it. See? I told you. Underworld loopholes. Whatever, man. I just beat up a god. Where's my money? Payment was based on capture. Dead or alive. No body, no money. What? You mean I went through all of this for nothing? I know a backdoor portal into the top level of hell. I can get us in there in no time if you're still game. Great! Let's go then! I'm so mad I can't even think! I can't tell you how happy that makes me. What's wrong with him? All underworlds generate an aura of pure fear. It keeps away trespassers. <laughs> the effects go away in about a half hour, if you can make it that long. He's a robot. How can he feel fear? It is not a feeling, yes. It is his fear protocol being activated by his programming. It is affecting me as well, yes. There is a strong electromagnetic field present in this realm, perhaps to regulate the heat. If we venture any further, we will both eventually cease to function. Flesh creatures would perish or go insane, yes. Oh, so you two idiots get to use your programming as an excuse, and I just have to admit that I'm too scared to move. <laughs> We're on the wrong side of town, man. You guys are completely useless. This place is no different than being at Dad's house. I got this. Dad's house? Who's your dad, Satan? <laughs> Ooh. Anxiety protocols over in. Wait, 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 wait. Some friends you guys are. You are actually gonna let her go out there and face all that danger alone, no regard for her well-being at all. You guys make me sick. Oh, how sweet. Besides, everybody knows girls can't fight. Uh, I'll kill him. <laughs> let me go. He's dead meat. We're all dead meat. <laughs> You look like hell. I am hell. I think I broke your dog. Hey, sup, Thor? Yo. I see. Not only did you defeat my pet, but you somehow managed to get past the fear aura of my realm. I assume you're here to rescue Thor, then. Rescue? Oh, yeah! <laughs> rescue, that's it. I'm not here for the money at all. No, sir. Could I have him, please? Nothing in life or death is free. You must best me in a contest of skill! So, rap battle it is, then! Bring forth the ruckus! I am the goddess! Most nasty of the underworld! In the fire and smoke is where your soul is hurled! The highest divinity of the descending shade! If you can't hear me yet, you need a hearing aid! Why you gotta go for the obvious? My ears are perfect, they aren't even the floppiest. Your rap is too slow, even my tail thinks so. I got a 286 processor that thinks faster in my toe. Hey, I got a joke for you. What's the difference in your rhyme and a bowl of stew? You give up? Uh, well, um, a bowl of stew has vegetables. Whoa! You think it's so funny? Well, listen to me, buddy. You'll never get your money, not even with a thousand gunny. Uncle Thor belongs to me. I will never set him free. How dare you come in here and kill my poor Garmy? Whoa, 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 lady. Your hellhound was wound tight, so I sent him night-night. Honestly, he wasn't even that tough. I'll bite and no rough. And why you gotta bring Gunny into this? He's my best friend forever, or my BFFFS. If you just give up, Thor, then I'll leave quietly. But if not, then it's high, and I know 12 kinds of robot karate. You're nothing but a toy. toy. You never found a boy. Boy, so fill your life with fun. fun. And then break you and be done. done. For all this disrespect, I demand a sacrifice. I wonder how it feels to end an artificial life. Whoa, you need some therapy. Maybe some anger management. You're going off into some weird daddy go love me tangent. I wish I could help you work through your daddy issues, but for real though, and I mean this, here's a box of tissues. <laughs> Great job, lady! Well, you are wasting my time, Thor got away! Hi, Dad! Is it my birthday? <laughs> Happy birthday! I, I look nothing like your father. He has yes, excellent hair. Well done. You buffoons let Thor escape. And now you've beaten this poor goddess senseless. Hey, I am not a baboon! 
I said buffoon. Your ears are massive. Do they not work? You failed twice. Now we have no idea where Thor is. It will take me weeks to track him again. The chin! <laughs> I, mean, I mean, contractor will be highly displeased. Return to your greasy spoon while I attempt to clean up this mess. Be gone. Oh, we'll leave, but not quietly, because my ears are perfect, and they are perfectly perfect. Your face, is, your face is not perfect, but my ears are perfect. Right, Gunny? We, we went to hell, we had to fight, now we're back, and there's no light, we lost our way, we lost our pay, now I'll never get my auto heal, and my food is getting colder when we pay for this meal, and Gunny is so dead, and Faye is depressed, and Gunny is a giant elephant. Ah, oh, that felt nice. Why are you guys so sad? Really bumming me out here, people. You in there, Metal Bunny? Come out and face the God of War. I don't want to. What? Why? Uh, Just get out of here. I'm coming in after you. Oh, uh, not again. Take it outside. Ah. You think you can go around attacking my crew? You're messing with the wrong pantheon. Hey, hey! Can you bring me a dictionary? I bring you war. Uh, Mashed potatoes! Order up! Bunny's log. December 30th, purple. <laughs> Why do I keep getting attacked by these funny dressed uh, people? Perhaps it was in response to our recent battle. Yes. What battles? The Library of the Universe. That's where the Encyclopedia Galactica is. If you got a problem, yo, it'll solve it. How did we get here so fast? You guys smell that? Smell? You realize I'm a freaking robot, right? Hey, Gunny, do you smell it? Smells like... treachery. Hey, it's that guy! <laughs> Watch his face! I should have ended you buffoons when I saved my daughter from your clutches and hell. What? I've had the Encyclopedia Galactica locked and sealed for your protection. Some knowledge is best left unknown. I don't suppose ending the Shura now is worth anything. <laughs> My name is Loki. A list came into my possession created by a being too cowardly to face us himself. Seeing my own kin upon this coward's list, I really had no choice but to possess his weak-minded servant and hire you bumbling fools to botch the job. Now I have no choice but to kickstart the endgame in hopes that it brings him great pain as he watches all that he has created be destroyed by the very forces he himself has put in place. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the apocalypse. <laughs> Diamond, we have to leave now. You two handle this. I'm going after her. Sure, no problem. We've got it. done it. Thank you. 
like I took your health now. Ha 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 Come and see. Yes. Come and see. Embraced after your last breath. Hello, children. string weapon if you feel you have the guts a fair fight we shall have just no kicking in the shot where did you get those from that tree yep those are universes full of civilizations i can't why would you now i'm upset i can't believe you fought so hard i've never broken sweat All the years that I've stood guard uh, A better foe I've not met What makes you so special? What is it that makes you tick? It must be love Or hate Or spite That usually does the trick So tell me, Metal Bunny Tell me so I know If I end up in Valhalla Why did I end up so? To get my money! Stay your hand, Metal Warrior! The Guardian of the Gates merely does his duty. There is a greater threat to us all than that of my treacherous blood brother, Loki. He has deceived each and every one of you. Huh? The chairman is the one you quest for. It was he who made the list that contains the death warrants for all my kind. Loki's vision is purely self-serving. <clears throat> While I can see the bigger picture. The threat to us all that must be stopped. I like your beard. I can see that you're clearly the brains of the family. Okay... So what you're saying is, we gotta take out the big guy, right? You got any idea how we're supposed to do that? Take this. But remember, it is dangerous to go alone. Mine! I wish you the best of luck. You'll need it. Honestly, I don't even know how we're still alive. I could help formulate a battle plan if you would like. Sure, that would be great. And coming! No, 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 no. <laughs> Man, 
man, I sure wish we could have got the battle plan out of that guy. I don't even know where we're going. We can always go ask Victor. He knows. The chairman will see you now. I appreciate you coming on such short notice. What, like we had a choice? All right, where's my cab? I'm out of here. A smart man gets it later. <laughs> Enough. It would seem everyone in this room has been played the fool. Regardless, you were hired, albeit under false pretenses, to do a job for me. One simple job, and you failed miserably. Wait a minute! You're the guy! Where's my money? Huh? I am you? sickened by your mere existence. A symbol of idolatry, hey. the spawn of Satan himself, uh. and a war machine created by men. No! But you... You're just a toy. You're no threat at all. My threat! I felt that. You killed my waitress and my chauffeur and my best friend! Down here was supposed to be our time! And you with the beautiful beard! Leading us on this wild moose chase! It's your fault I got them killed! Now I'm out of money! I'm out of friends! And my tail doesn't work! And it's gone! So what am I supposed to do now? Well done, buddy. Well done indeed. Thanks to you, everything can now be returned to as it should be. Wow. My friend! <laughs> my useless, useless friend! Where were you that whole time? I could have died and I still haven't got the money for an auto repair. <laughs> Ew, what is this? The color is a side effect. Did you just abduct me? Was I pro? No, no, no. I've had your alloys replaced with dwarven metal that is self-healing. You'll never so much as see a scratch on that glorious golden chassis ever again. So that's a no on the auto repair then. Did you actually make him stupider? So wait, let me get this straight. The big guy is dead? And by taking that throne, now you're the new big guy? It would appear so. You knew about this all along, didn't you? <laughs> of course. Heimdall sees all. Something as important as a list being made that orders the death of my entire pantheon would certainly be brought to my attention, would it not? You could have been honest with us from the start and saved us all a lot of trouble. Or just taken the guy out yourself. We risked our lives getting this far based on a lie. <sighs> The gods have an enforced agreement, Faye. Mm, yep. It's not like the old days when we could spread our wrath at will. Nope. We're no longer allowed to harm each other directly. Oh, yeah. Since it was Bunny that did this, there'll be no punishment handed mm, down. Yep. And in order for Odin to take the throne, mm -hmm. the big guy had to go. Zing. Permanent-like. Yeah. And that makes manipulating people and putting them in danger okay? My dear girl, in spite of your dislike for him, do you truly believe your father would allow anyone to harm you or those that you hold dear? Where do you think the weapon that Bunny used came from in the first place? Figures. Explains why the big guy was so allergic to it. So what happens now? Yes. I started making things right. Could you start by making it where he can't sing? There are some things even the gods have no control over. Like science! <laughs> this is it! It is the end! We have had some good times and so bad, but I've never been so glad to see my friends! Aww. My useless friends! Aww. I had to do it on my own, or mostly Gunny threw some bunk in me and Faye! No help were they! Whenever trouble was abound, those two were never around to see me win! Victorious again! I never read from any fight or fright to take his mind! Special day! We got a rest! We passed the test, Odin's back in the high seat! For my people, what a treat! The chairman's gone! peculiar creature, the most bizarre I've ever seen. It's not so much that he's strange, if anything, he's annoying. I think you guys are too tough on him. He's just trying to do his best. He is my best friend forever, and I will fight him. 
You guys mean everything to me, and I do it all again. There's only one thing bugging me still. Has anyone seen my pen? I'm still very much injured and could maybe use some medical assistance for my suffering. Weenie. Hello? He he oh, oh. It's in the bone! It's in the bone! Now here we are! Here we are! We're at the end! We're at the end. We've beat all of the things! Now we're on this last cutscene! What's going on? I have been put back in charge. The future is looking great. As long as Vikings rule the world, I'll be the head of state. My family tree I've seen for now. I've done all that I could. Really? I'm off to pull more pranks now like a selfish Robin Hood. What has happened? What's gone on? Did I do something wrong? I woke up in a room of books. Now I'm getting dirty looks. At least you got a busy man. I'm stuck in outer space. But the end of Superman. Man, I'm stuck in his best game. Now here we are. We sing together. Like we're together. Sounds like a luxury. I slink from street to street. I flinch every time I hear my name and I hide underneath a sheet. Oh man, up you sissy girl, at least you'll see more freeze. I am so quite upset as my father forgets birthday. I can't see so good these days, my eyes black and blue. I'm unsure of the future now, I've only half a world view. You've kicked some good at wrapping up loose ends, but then this one stings. You've kicked some of the apocalypse and all the hell it blows. Oh, here we are. We're at the end. Wait, 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 what did they just say? It sounds like we're set up for a sequel. Chairman's dead. A sequel? That's cool. Yeah, 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 we get it. The chairman's dead and now we're in the sky. But what's gonna happen next? We don't know. We hope you enjoyed yourself while you played this game. I ran out of words to sing. Well, anyway, I would like to thank uh, the great Gunny. Gunny did a great, good job, Gunny. Good job. You did great. Uh, also, the guy that holds the microphone, he was fantastic. Um, there's also the, the guys that do the lighting. Uh, good job, fellas. And uh, and Faye. Faye, was she great or what? And then there's Victor and uh, Ganny right there. And <sighs> it's all about the money with these guys, seriously. Oh, well. Anyway, thank you later! Smells like smoke and sulfur outside. Ouch, my skin. Oh, jeez. So much for... Oh! <laughs> who, who are you guys? This one is weak in both mind and body. This vessel will do well for the master. Yes. Ooh.